Just eight questions. How you doing? I'm doing good. How you doing? I'm all right. You look you look great as always. Excited about this movie. I think I've gotten more creeped out over the weeks since I've seen the movie. Just every time I see the commercial, I, this guy Dennis Quaid is creeping me out. How's it, how's it feel to be a part of this movie that people are saying is creepier than us and not hating on us? But no, oh, well, I loved us. Um, I mean, it makes me feel great because I feel like everything we set out to do happened. Like, we're this small, independent film. We're all out there moving lights, going to the next shot. And um, everybody that was there wanted to be there and wanted to do great work. And Dion is, like, one of the most just deserving people of just everything that's going on. And Roxanne. And, um, and yeah, I just feel like for someone who's a connoisseur of stuff in this space, I'm really, really proud of it. And it's exciting for it to have, like, that 90s throwback where everybody's activated in the theater and having fun. And... Yeah, I'm just thankful and happy and appreciative. Yeah. Uh, as a young actress, you are still like a real industry veteran. You have a lot of titles under your belt. I, I wanted you to reflect on John Singleton real quickly, just because you've been part of this industry and everything. What has been his impact and what is, what's your feelings with, you know, seeing him, uh, his untimely death? Like, I mean, um, Obviously, like his family, you know, I think about his family and I'm, I'm, yeah, I'm looking at like Tyrese's page and Taraji and I know how impacted they are. And the, the thing for me, I think that that I think about the most is like watching him as a director was the first time that I was told that I didn't have to conform to be anything else to do the thing that I love. That being exactly who I am authentically, all of it, all the stuff that you walk in the room, people are like, oh, they might not accept that. Being all of that and embodying that um, is, is that's your superpower. Your authenticity is your superpower. And when you lean into that, um, you can do incredible things. And to have a legacy like his, there's not gonna be many, you know? And I mean, he was like 22, 24 when he did Boys in the Hood. I mean, he's a baby. So, and he's, and he's I mean, 51 is young, you know? So my heart goes out to his family. I am thankful that we had him. Um, I am forever influenced by, inspired by, and grateful for his example and for his legacy. And he was always, always amazing to me. So, yeah. Thank you for your time. You're always amazing on and off screen. I can really say genuinely that you got the good vibes going all the way around. So thank you for everything, Megan. Oh yeah, definitely. Yeah,